Hello everyone, I'll be uh, explaining uh, how to assign privileges and permissions uh, in LDM admin and in LDM uh, admin console. So starting off, so today's assign agendas are to assign privileges uh, and permissions uh, to users groups, assign data permissions to resources, users and groups, resource configuration and assign resource configuration level permissions. And this feature, uh, and also note, this feature is only uh, in uh, 10.5. Starting off, so first, uh, how to assign roles and privileges to users and groups. So we can do this from the admin console. First, we need to log in into admin console, then click on the security tab, and then select the particular user or group. And uh, on the right side, you'll be able to see the privileges as you can see from this screenshot. And then uh, select the particular uh, service type which you want, and click on edit, and then change the uh, privileges, and, uh, and then assign the privileges and roles. Next, we have what are privileges. So privileges, uh, you can assign uh, privileges to users and groups for your application services such as EDC, DPM, MRS, etc. And you can assign different privileges to a users for each application service of the same service type. So as you can see, there are different types of privileges under EDC. So you have API privileges, Kafka privileges, resource management privileges. You can assign them to that user. Next, coming to roles. So roles is nothing but a collection of privileges that you can assign to a user or group within an organization and uh, which has a specific role. Like for example, if the user is a developer, administrator, basic user or advanced user. Next, as you can see from the screenshot, you can click on the roles and then assign the various roles which you required. And then you can next is assigning data permissions to resources. Uh, so then you can assign, we can assign our data permissions to resources, users and groups from the LDM admin. So once we log into LDM admin, we need to select on the manage tab and then click on security. So then you can assign, you will be able to see the different uh, users. And then accordingly, you can assign the uh, various data permissions to that users. There are four data permissions. You have read, read and write the metadata and data read and all permissions so read is nothing but you can you will be able to see the details of assets and resources and edc and read and write is you can assign data domains business terms uh, to these assets next coming to the metadata and data read all the users included or uh, in the user groups will be able to view the value frequency of an asset in the uh, edc that is in the ldm catalog and over here we can business terms and data domains are called as enrichments or just for information and next you have all permissions so in this all permissions you'll be able to add the data domain business terms to each assets in the edc and also view the value frequency for these assets next coming on to the next one resource configuration level permissions so this you can assign a read scan write and no access permissions at a resource level so but uh, note please note this uh, feature is only added from 10.5 so we need to configure first uh, restrict con configuration permissions while creating a new resource and then select uh, and then we need to go to the security tab and select the resource and the users which require and uh, users and accordingly provide the permissions now jumping on to the demo uh, so first uh, first we need to log into the uh, admin console uh, which i've already done so you need to go to the security tab and then you need to select the users and also one uh, you need to select the user tab over here then select the user which you need to assign the privileges and roles so once you select the users you'll be able to see all uh, three tabs on the right overview privileges and permissions so you should select on the per privileges tab and once you click on the per edit you'll be able to see roles and privileges so accordingly you need to select the roles uh, present and roles uh, to assign to the users and this is for roles and this is for privileges so if you click on privileges tab in the catalog service you'll be able to see different privileges and you can assign them accordingly this is about the uh, privileges at the admin console next coming on to the administrator or ldm admin so once you can you can see oh, i have already logged into the admin console so you need to select the manage tab uh, you can need to click on security and then click on test the and then you'll be able to see all the users and there's a limitation for the number of users displayed in this list only 250 users will be displayed uh, and if you have more than that you need to use the uh, scroll bar uh, to search for it 
so once you select the user uh, your user you can select the different types of uh, resources and provide the data permissions accordingly uh, and similarly you can do it as well as the resources so for one particular resource you can select more users and then provide the various data permissions permissions and there's another way to assign these permissions so you have the set default permissions so if you click on the set default permissions you'll be able to see the different users so you can select the particular user and then you will have two options over here you'll have all resources and custom so in all resources uh, you can provide if you if you select all resources all the resources which have been created in the edc will be assigned this particular permission for the particular users which you assign it for example if i give read and write then the all the user all the resources of for that particular user will have the read and write permissions so custom is you can select the type of resource and then provide the various permissions accordingly the difference between this and the previous one is over here this is the type of uh, i mean this is according to a uh, type of resource that is the resources which have been configured in the edc and coming to the next feature that is resource level permissions so when we create a particular resource or if you go to the permissions tab you'll be able to see this restrict configuration permission so if you enable this then you'll be able to provide resource level permissions for all for this particular resource so you can provide you can do that by going to the security tab uh, select the particular resource where uh, this option is enabled uh, so if this is enabled in test and then select the users which you want uh, uh, to provide these particular permissions, configure permissions, read, scan, and write. So if you just provide it, it will get assigned. So this is about the uh, privilege, assigning privileges and uh, roles uh, to different users in the EDC. Uh, this is how we assign our roles and privileges to users from admin console and LDM admin. If you have any feedbacks regarding this video, please reach out to us from these two links. And thank you for watching the video.